Hi, today I'll be showing you how to use film-free water slide decal papers. So for those of you that are not familiar with the word decal, let me just give you a brief overrun. A decal or a transfer paper allows you to choose any image you want from the computer, print and transfer to any surfaces including curvatures. All you need is these papers, a standard laser printer, a pair of scissors, hair dryer or oven, tissues, glue, and squeegee rubber. So without further ado, let's get started. First, open image editing program in your computer such as Adobe Photoshop or Illustrator. If you are using Photoshop, simply right click, go to transform and reflect. We want to print the mirror image because the decal will be applied face down. Print the image on the glossy side so make sure that when you feed the paper it is facing the right way. Because you'll be using laser toner, you don't have to wait for the ink to dry. Once you get the printed image, you can then start cutting it out with a pair of scissors. Make sure that you leave enough margins around the image. Place the decal in a bowl of water for around half a minute. Take the decal out and wait until the backing starts to loosen for removal. It should take roughly around 20 to 30 seconds at room temperature. While you're waiting, use a brush to apply glue on the surface where the decal will be applied. Ideally, you would want to use glue W1 for the decal type A and W2 for type B. Apply the image facing down and remove the backing paper underneath. If the image is not in the right spot, you can always move it around with your thumbs. Once you're happy with its placement, straighten out the wrinkles until it is nice and flat. Start removing the moisture and air underneath with a squeegee. Blow dry the finished product with a hair dryer for 2-3 to three minutes. If you want a better quality, you can also put it in the oven at around 100 degrees for 10 minutes. Remove the final film slowly. To make the ink more resistant and durable, heat it in the oven again at 200 degrees for 10 minutes. You can also blow dry it for 3 to 5 minutes. And that brings to the end of our tutorial. If you want more information about our products, please visit our website at www.sunnyscoper.co.kr. You can also email us if you have any questions. I've put the email address down below. 